Hello everyone, we are back with Glenn Velvet Reviews today, and uh, I got this Ikea furniture uh, uh, from the Ikea in Paramus, New Jersey. If you saw my other videos, I got a 60 gallon breeder, so I need a stand for it. So Ikea, I obviously, it's not going to be, you know, I, I need to um, modify this stand to withhold, um, you know, a thousand pounds or so worth of stuff. Uh, but so this I'm not gonna obviously I'm gonna modify this add some two by fours in later videos or whatever uh, But right now I'm just gonna build it because I think this was my cheapest route uh, You know with kind of making it look nice to be able to reuse it because uh, Down the road say you move or whatever the case may be at least this is white It'll blend in anywhere and even if I don't want to use it for a fish tank it's still a kitchen stand i can use it in a kitchen in my rental properties you know i can maybe add it in there you know what i mean if if i'm redoing one of the kitchens again or you know whatever the case may be i'm just saying that's why i did this this way i can reuse it if i just build a fish tank stand at a two by four uh then that's it it's always going to be a fish tank stand and nothing else i can't really do anything else with it i put a two foot um measuring uh ruler over there and then there's a four foot over there just so you guys can help size what's going on All right, so I finally found the instructions. So here, uh, they, oh, here they are right here. You can, guys can give that a pause. It's a little dark. Sorry, but this is the best I can do. So just in case you lose yours, you can um, come back here and see what's up in the video. All right, so that's it. So I'm gonna build this real well, not real quick, but I'm gonna build this, and then you guys are gonna I'm gonna speed up the video, obviously, and that's it. All right.
All right, everyone, we are back. Uh, I had to charge my phone. Um, I put on the back already, and I didn't put that in the video. All you do is the white part faces the inside, so you'll see that. And you just make sure that the corners are all square, okay? So when you're nailing this in, push the corners into the this backing and the bottom. So make sure it's square and nice and tight, and then drive the nails in there, okay? So it's very easy, I don't know, they give you a bunch of nails. I don't think there's really like a set thing where to put them, so I kind of just hammer them all over the place. All right, everyone, I am completely done. Furniture, there it is right there. So that's pretty much what it uh, is gonna look like. You can put the doors on either side. I put the door on this side because uh, I'm gonna be pulling out stuff and going this way, not this way. So I don't want the door in the way, that's kind of stupid. Um, so I put it this way and then I know I probably should have put, it doesn't matter. I put it, my doors a certain way because I'm gonna use it because this is gonna be in the corner and there's a door here. So it's not gonna make sense for me to have the door open, you know what I mean? Um, so this is pretty much it. The countertop's okay, it feels pretty heavy. Um, this is the drawer, pretty big drawer. Wow, that's a big drawer, which is cool. Um, it's not ball bearing or smooth or anything like that. It's, uh, it's just a regular drawer that you would get at like Staples, like those cheap ones. Um, so it's, you know, it's pretty loud when you're opening it. And uh, let's see how loud it is. Well, pretty loud when you slam it too. Um, so that's the inside. I'm not gonna put uh, use, uh, as you saw, I'm, I'm gonna put my salt water mix there. 
So that's not gonna, you know, I'm not gonna put a shelf in there, but there's a shelf here and they have an extra shelf that you can put in as well. So you can either hang it off either side. I hung mine off this side because I'm gonna have a door on that side. And this is kind of the back of it. So, I mean, so this is the uh, back of uh, kind of what you can expect it to look like as well. <clears throat> so you can run electric out of there, which will be great. You can run electric out of here, which will be great. So you have all this area to really, you know, uh, do whatever you want over here. So uh, that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, and that's it. So that's it for the building review that I got right here. Um, we are going to come back. We're going to give this thing a test. I'm going to put, uh, like, you know, about two, 300 pounds on it, and we're going to see where it gives away. I'm going to, um, you know, obviously spread it out evenly. I'm not just going to put it on one side, uh, but I'm going to spread out, you know, a couple of hundred pounds on here. We're going to see where it gives away, and then I know where I'm going to have to put the, uh, two by fours. All right. So that's it for Glenn Bell with reviews on the building of it. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. I would love to know. Also subscribe to my channel. Join me on my review adventures as I try to put up stuff to help out the community, just like I get help from the community. All right, everybody enjoy. Be safe. I'm out. Bye-bye.